in your own words. People say that to you. You know, you know when you hear that a lot in a classroom or in a courtroom, they'll say to you, tell us in your own words. Do you have your own words? Gotcha, bitch. Bob Arrow is the gift that keeps on giving. Oh, let's look at his words. Straighter, yep, not yep. roundhouse yep. right hand. And that's what we've been talking about, the straight shot. It's the one where he gets leverage on it. I don't want to kill Pull somebody back for a, a little bit. Seconds. Nah, I want a body on my record. Now, I want to see you fight motherfuckers. I do. All right, I'm with you. I'm with you as long as as long as you're trying to fight the great the, your, or the, the the best competition. Welcome to the graveyard. Click the link if you dare to bury you alive. I'm prepared to. Welcome to the graveyard. You get your sources from clowns. So when you come around, we're here. Welcome to the graveyard. Click the link if you dare to bury you alive. I'm prepared to. Welcome to the graveyard. You get your sources from clowns. So when you come around, we're here. Fight the best if you ain't with the moto. Just click the link, bitch, and get buried like the rest. It ain't gonna work how you want it. These trolls already tried, too many come but don't leave. So if you hear, you gotta die. Spitting straight facts. These bitches crying cause they hate that. The LDBC's the top topic, bitch. Hate that. We to bring the truth to these fans. So why you hate? I'ma laugh and keep counting these bands. Come to the graveyard. Click the link, get the bands. Bury you alive, I'm prepared to. Welcome to the graveyard, you get your sources from clowns, so when you come around, we don't hear you. Welcome to the graveyard, click the link if you dare to, bury you alive, I'm prepared to. Welcome to the graveyard, you get your sources from clowns, so when you come around, we don't hear you. Welcome to the graveyard. Uh, uh, ESPN uh, app, ESPN Plus has done splendid numbers uh, for in the Jake Paul Tommy Fury fight uh, and they uh, all of the UFC fights on pay-per-view are done on the uh, uh, ESPN plus app and their numbers are fairly good and they want to play us stupid and you guys allow yourselves to be played stupid espn plus is an american over-the-top subscription video streaming service available in the united states blah 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 owned by the espn division of walt disney in partnership with espn inc joint venture walt disney company owns 80 percent stank uh stake the Hearst Company owns 20, the remaining 20%. So we know who the uh, hedge funds are. Whatever. It is one of Disney's three flagship subscriptions. Disney Plus, Hulu, and ESPN Plus. Fucking insane to me. <laughs> it's insane to me, man. So they said a whole bunch of other, there's a whole bunch of other things about Disney Plus, but just screw down to the bottom. Featured content on ESPN Plus includes combat sports, including coverage of the UFC and top-ranked boxing. Now, with them covering two platforms when it comes to um, when it comes to the sports of when it comes to combat sports, they cover the UFC and they cover top-ranked boxing. That's what ESPN Plus covers. You would think that they only cover those, that they can maximize it. Well, they do. Um, Terrence Crawford joined Top Rank. I mean, he joined ESPN Plus um, in 2018 with Jeff Horn. That was the first fight on the ESPN Plus. Um, he's had six total fights on the app. Six total. He's done two pay-per-views. Um, his first pay-per-view was against Amir Khan, and it was in qu quarter two, quarter two 
um, of 2019. That was when his first pay-per-view was. And it did uh, two point, no, it did uh, 150,000 pay-per-view buys. And at the time, there was 2.2 million subscribers with ESPN Plus at that time. The second pay-per-view with Sean Porter was in quarter four of 2021. They had 17.1 million subscribers on that app at that time. It was a 700% increase in subscribers. Yet Terrence Crawford went from 150,000 pay-per-view buys when he only had 2.2 million subscribers down to 135 pay-per-view buys when they had 17.1 million. So when they had less subscribers, he was 150. When they have 700% increase in subscribers, he's down 15,000 to 135. So that's, that's not him. It's the app. It's not him. Because according to him, you know, the app was the reason on why he didn't sell. It was the app. The app was the reason. He said... Sure, for sure, man. I feel like, you know, there was a lot of opportunities left on the table. You know what I mean? Not, not only with fighters, but also with uh, pay-per-view. You know what mm -hmm. I mean? Like, for instance, me and Sean Porter fought on the app. Right. You know, yeah. there were so many people that was telling me they don't know how to get the app on the TV. They don't know how to do it. And, you know, the the average elderly or person that doesn't, you know, know tech, they're not going to know how to get the app on the TV. So what they do, they don't buy it. Yeah. You know, so I feel like, you know, that was a... a a setup at, at his own right, right then and there. Mm. So putting you on an app where when you fight Sean, there was 17.1 million subscribers, up 700% in subscriptions. Putting you on that somehow meant that they were setting you up. That's what it somehow meant. Okay, um, well, let, let's let's do something right quick because at the same time where you were fighting and in between that time, so when you fought Amir Khan and when you fought uh, Sean Porter, right? There was some other events that were ongoing. So let's take a look at the other events and let's just see what, um, what else was going on. Um, September 1st, 2018, I mean, 2020. September 1st, uh, UFC 246. It did 1,353,429 pay-per-view buys. Okay, that was in quarter one. Uh, quarter two, UFC 249, May 9th, 2020. 700,000 pay-per-view buys. All right. Still in quarter two. UFC 251. July 11th, 2020. 1,300,000 pay-per-view buys. Oh, still in quarter three. No, we're quarter three. I'm sorry. UFC 252. 500,000 pay-per-view buys. Quarter three still, UFC 253, 700,000 pay-per-view buys. Quarter four, 2020, UFC 254, 675,000 pay-per-view buys. Quarter one, uh, oh, quarter two, I'm sorry of 2021. Oh, no, that is quarter one. Yep. UFC 259. 800,000 pay-per-view buys. Quarter two. Um, 
uh, May 15th, 2021, quarter two, UFC 262, 300,000 pay-per-view buys. Quarter two, uh, June 12th, 2021, UFC 263, 600,000 pay-per-view buys. Quarter four, the exact same quarter that Terrence Crawford fought Sean Porter in. UFC 269, 500,000 pay-per-view buys. So could it be, could it be that Terrence Crawford just don't sell? Because also in quarter four, where UFC 263 was at, and Terrence Crawford versus Sean Porter was at, in quarter four, Bob Arum said this. Well, Terrence Crawford, I think, is clearly uh, one of the best fighters in the world today. He's tremendously skilled. Unfortunately, he hasn't shown to be anybody, to be a fighter who've been a, who's been a draw on pay-per-view for whatever reason. So we've... Uh, put him in the best fights we can. Uh, unfortunately, we've lost money on every fight that he's done. Uh, and uh, he keeps insisting, and I can understand his point of view. I'm, I'm the best, I should get paid like the best. Uh, so if somebody is willing to come and put up the money that Crawford is demanding, he, as I said, he should do a fight for some other promoter if he's going to make more money. We're really uh, at the limit of what we can pay him. And uh, maybe somebody will pay him more and will be able to make a profit, which obviously it's a business, uh, from that, and so be it. We're gonna turn up with B O B L K time. <laughs> you know what I mean? We gonna do our thing, man. We stepping up to the plate, man. They turning, they turning boxing around, man. All the biggest fights, you know what I mean? Going through them. You know they the new, they the new wave. You know, hey, giving these fighters, you know what I mean? They just do. You want to fight this guy, you want to fight this guy, they're going to make it happen. It's simple. December 10th, you know what I mean? Tune in to BLK. P B L B <laughs> B L K Pride. Black Pride, baby. We in the building. Tune in, y'all. If y'all don't, you know what I mean? Y'all some haters. Got a problem figuring out if you're from me or Spence. And you ain't black. If y'all do, you know what I mean? It is what it is, man. Support the kid. Now I know um, that I have the ESPN app. And I also know that I had to download it either to my smart TV or to my phone or my tablet or my computer. I had to download the app. So that 5,000 plus thing back there, let me let you know what that means. If it did more than 6,000 downloads, it would say 6,000 plus. If it did more than 100,000 downloads, it would say 100,000 plus. But since it did less than 6,000, it says 5,000 plus. So I'm saying I'm not even gonna go into it no more. But this is the man that said he was held back on pay-per-views because he was fighting on an app. Sure, for sure, man. I feel like, you know, there was a lot of opportunities left on the table. You know, what I mean, not not only with fighters, but also with uh, pay per view, you know what mm -hmm. I mean? Like, for instance, me and Sean Porter fought on the app. 
we're gonna turn up with B O B L K time. <laughs> right. You know, yeah. there were so many people that was telling me they don't know how to get the app on the TV. They turn it, they turn it boxing around, man. All the biggest fights, you know what I mean, going through them. You know, they the new they the new wave, you know? Hey. They don't know how to do it and you know the the average elderly or person that doesn't you know no tech they not gonna know how to get the app on the tv december 10th you know what i mean tune in to be okay be okay so what they do they don't buy it yep. you know so i feel like you know that was a uh a, a setup at at his own right right then and there mm. And then he fights on an app. Not only does he fight on an app, he says he was held back on an app that at the time he fought Sean Porter had 17 million subscribers. 17 million. So then he fights on an app with 5,000 plus. <laughs> but those are his words. BFTB, shout to the mighty, mighty LDBC. I'm out.